Okay, today I'd like to talk about uh, religion problems. Well, uh, today I was talking with, uh, with my dad about religion. He said that Bible is something that you know it have been passing on for generation after generations. So, like in a sense, religion um, is there for a reason, and it have it its own power. However, my belief against religion is kind of a little bit different, because I believe over the years, like a lot of wars are caused by religion differences, such as ISIS would be one example, and in a sense, like um, governor, uh, I mean govern ideologies such as democracy, communism, um, those are kind of religion type of difference except um, those are politic differences and um, and, and that, that, that makes things very uneasy because in science people doesn't really get into war because of science you know people with scientific mind are less likely to get into war, get into conflict because there are reasons like science is a, is a neutral one for a lot of things. Science is neutral. Well, religion, it can bring out hatred and problem within race and gender. So yeah, that's one of the main concerns that I have about religion. Of course, personally, I'm not into religion and I believe Bible is even, you know, first people who know my personal story is that I used to go to after school program that is hosted by church. So in a sense, like a lot of ideology that they talk about in the after-school program are related to Christianity, and I spent about four, four or five years in the after-school program every day, and I often look at the all the Bible, all the stories that go through. So I'm not really, I'm not <coughs> blind in the religion aspect, and I do believe that religion has power. But I just found that it's not on a neutral one. Like system philosophy is designed on a neutral one with science. And religion is less so. And that makes it rather worrisome for, for me. And so the number one problem with, uh, with religion is that it's not on a ground of neutral. Uh, a lot of war started by that. And it can bring out some extremism within religion. But of course, like uh, the trend is that in the, in the human history, um, people are more extreme in religion and modern science changed that because more and more science more and more people become religious and more and less and less extremism well of course extremism still exists such as ISIS today like is reflected today but, but they're getting killed off by the general ideology you know like the interests of the United States you know, we bomb them, we use drones to kill them and they die more than they kill. You know, more people die from ISIS than the people they kill, which is a good thing. So right now, like extremism are getting killed, even though some people are still seeing them as a growing force, but you know, it's not. And that's a problem with religion. So yeah, this would be this topic. Thank you for listening.